myself in here because Parrot won't stop squawking and I'm busy. So what I'm doing is uh, I'm just starting off now first of my giant seeds. I'm going to do one a month for four or five months. So I shall get the timing right with these plants then. I'll just keep them alive in that greenhouse all the winter. So I'll have stagings from one, you know what I mean? Because I've got my timing wrong on pumpkin. Did that too late. Didn't do a cabbage, I'm gonna do them on this year. Yeah, I'd long been, I did that too late, because it's just starting growing now. Didn't do a marrow. And the giant onion I've never grown from seed. I've got that give me, so I'm gonna start that early and do one a month. So I'm going in succession, so I should have one ready for a competition. I'm just wait well, I've not done the big tomato because I did that too early this year. So I'm gonna do that at the same time as the tomatoes. And here, them's the seeds there, that's the giant pumpkin, giant cabbage, yard long bean, giant marrow, giant onion, because that's a 12 pod. We'll put some web lettuce in, because we can plant that. So all I've got there is just uh, tap water, not rain water. I'll let that soak it up, it might need some more. When that starts getting damp at top, I'll let it warm up a bit in here, and then I'll plant them. And then uh, off we'll go with our first ones, I'll leave them in here till they come out, till they sprout. I'll transfer them to the greenhouse, so it'll be 18th of every month. From now till, well, Whatever, whatever seeds I've got. I think I've got six seeds of the giant Mara. So, got six months. So what's that? Six months, six months. What in September, October, November, December, January, February, March. Yeah, March is what I'll be that. So we'll do one a month from now till March. I'll keep them in there in stages, we'll see how they grow. So I'm going to bob them in there and then go and make a brew and strangle this parrot. See you in a bit. And there they are. I've got my hand on. And I'll shut up. Yeah, that's all right. <coughs> Giant onion, giant marrow, yard long bean, giant cabbage, giant pumpkin, and some web lettuce and the rest of these. I'm going to put a few in. So, Bob's your uncle. So, first batch in. Keep our eye on them now, but we go away tomorrow in caravan for a couple of days, well, for five days. So, I'll just make sure that's got plenty of water in before we go, it should be all right. And when we get back, hopefully, all of them should have been sprouted. Five days, yeah, should imagine so in here, it's nice and warm. That coffee and tea is doing okay in there. I've got a little uh, clematis in there that I've started off. So that's just tea off now, up that stick. And then that's that uh, lemon tree, what I've had up a lot, no, the orange tree, sorry. Keeps growing back and dying off, but it seems like it in there, so it's okay in there, I tied it out over there. So we'll be starting uh, working in there a lot now while winter's coming. Get some eating in there and uh, off we'll go. So that's the first ones anyway, because I've been all gardening outside today. It was uh, plot inspections this morning. So I did them first thing, so I didn't really have time to do any gardening, but there's not a lot to do. I took that wood row around from around them uh, pink fur apple potatoes. And they're going, uh, 
I've got all the buckets lined up and I'll do them in the morning. I'm going on in the morning. So I'll get them done in the morning. In fact, we'll have a look at them in the morning. I'll put this up in the morning with that, so I'll see you then. Boom. Well, we're back. Back from Abagala. Sunday morning. So I've got to get them spuds today. I'll do them in a minute. See how many we've got. Pink fur apple. I've just been tidying up and weed out front. Green green hands out now. Front up here. Oop. But I just snapped my brush. So that was not fun. But it happened. So I've got everything out of here. Oh, a bit echo in here now. What I've done, I've put a flag out of the side and I won't fill that with stone. Just in the middle. So it's like that tunnel up there. Uh, yeah, we'll sort this great van out now, because look where it's got to. So we've only four foot to go on that top one. About six foot with that one. Excuse me. I've got that one to grow around, right, but I need to put a piece of string on there now, like this wire. I won't do that in a bit. But, uh, that needs a good salting. Even go around with weed till I've got some weed colour at home. I'm going to tidy up around here as well. So, bit of a busy day. What time is it? Quarter past nine. I had a lie in this morning. Only got here about half seven. So, we'll have a quick brew now and then whoosh, crack on. Boom. Getting through these buckets. And, uh, look what I've just found. Hey, bless the spotted guru. Very, very rare to capture him in the wild. Let's, let's, let's have a look what we've got. Ah, got about a quarter of a bucket there. That's out of uh, ten buckets. So we've got another eight buckets to go. Uh, Tony will tip one out here. Tip top Tony. <laughs> tip top, top tipper. Top tipper. Yeah. Are you ready for that? Three, two, one. I've never done a potato reveal, mate. See what we've got. Oh, nothing in that one. Oh, is it a dog that I've got? A couple of worms in. Oh, oh I don't know, yeah. mate. Oh, there they are. They're all at the top, aren't they? Yeah. So they keep away from that manure. Because what I did, I put manure at the bottom and just compost about that far up. But. Yeah. Yeah. I got that bucket. Weird shape, aren't they? Is there any green ones like that? Tony, I'll take them. Yeah, take them out here. Yeah. Top that. Ooh, there we are. Oh, yes. Yeah, there's a few. Good few in there. Get them in that bucket. That big bucket. Should have my tripod, shouldn't I, really? Something about, about 15, 16 pounds, isn't it? Yeah, it's not bad then, is it? There's only one spud went to each. I think we're overboard. I do like the shape of these, though, pal. Yeah. Weirdos, eh? Yeah, peeling, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Need a little knife for peeling them, won't you? You look at him. Um, so I oh, Mr. Man. Yeah, all sorts of weird different sizes. He's ready to take that pan on him, doesn't he? Stood the hooker out, beast. Weird, isn't it? Nobly. 
A couple of wayward ones got in as well, haven't they? Yeah, big white ones. Can we sell white ones now? Oh, right, definitely. Okay. Can sell white ones. A big got... knobbly pink, isn't it? Huh? A big knobbly pink one. What colour is that? Sorry, off white. <laughs> Yeah. 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 It's like an alien ray gun, that one. Yeah. We've seen before, they're a bit like Jerusalem. They look like, a, like Jerusalem artichokes a bit. They're like that sort of shape, aren't they? I don't know. I've never seen one. Jerusalem yeah. artichoke. They look like, like a bit like ginger, aren't they? Yeah. Is that like ginger Yeah. I'll just. Uh, can't wait to see Shirley trying to peel them after. <laughs> They're quite prolific, aren't they? <laughs> you got a few. Yeah. I think, uh, how many more buckets have you got? Yeah, uh, like about six or seven. That's a lot. Two, four, six, seven buckets left. Because this is like a 50 litre bucket, this one. It's a big bucket, isn't it? Yeah. Odd, odd shapes, and... Yeah, they're weird, aren't they? Some, uh... Yeah, that's a good one, isn't it? He's <laughs> like, a, like a sea lion. Right? Well, that's one word for <laughs> it, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Look at it for, for until it's proud as punch, doesn't it? Yeah. I don't know what these are, but they're going in the chip, man. Yeah, they're not, they're not dead big, but they're there. Pink fur apple. I think they'd be good, good boilers and roasters and what have you, wouldn't they, really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's tons, isn't there? I'll get yeah. a rake out, pal. Loads of little ones, I'll rake it. Here, let me turn myself, I'll rake it. I'm gonna rake it. That's about it, I think. Uh, what time is it? Ooh, quarter to one. Missus will be thinking I've got lost. Uh, Dented them there, filled that one up. So that's nice and full now. And uh, put all them pink fur apple out. So then was what we're drying last week, I think there's uh, Maris Piper, Maris Pier. So we'll leave them and put them in that sack tomorrow when they dry. So I'm going green. Right, I think that's about it. Oh, see you in the morning. Get something else done.